I finished that program in early April. By summertime, my rheumatologist fired me. She said that I was in remission and that my labs were so clean, she didn't want to see me for at least a year. That is my favorite news when someone gets fired by their rheumatologist. I'm Dr. Brooke Goldner, and I was fired by my rheumatologist over 15 years ago after having lupus for 12 years straight. So I know that feeling, and I live for other people to have that feeling too. I can't wait to show you the rest of what Julie has to say about how she went from having mixed connective tissue disease, barely able to function and be there for her kids, to having tons of energy, super mom, starting her own business, feeling amazing, and getting fired by her rheumatologist. Let's hear more from Julie. And so I suffered, I mean, really suffered. I, I was pretty much bed bound. I felt awful all of the time. I was so exhausted and I was in a lot of pain, like never ending lots of pain. Um, it started out with really bad digestive issues. I, um, I was extremely constipated. I was also having diarrhea on and off. I was really, really bloated. Um, I was having issues pretty much any time I ate. So that's like the very beginning. Um, from there, I started to get really fatigued. Um, I started experiencing a lot of joint pain and just being really uncomfortable. On top of everything else, I was having like heart palpitations. I was feeling shaky all the time. Um, I just felt like, I felt like I was vibrating inside. I felt like my heart was beating in my throat and it was really erratic, really scary. These heart palpitation episodes like made me feel like I was having a heart attack. I, w I actually went to the emergency room several times because I thought I was having a heart attack. So I, I just got to this place where I felt pretty hopeless. I couldn't keep up with my kids. I was really, really, really tired all the time. I went from this place where I just kind of felt like super mom years ago, and I was able to handle all these things to like not even being able to take care of myself and being scared to get out of bed and scared to live my life because I was afraid to get too far away from my house or too far away from a hospital because I was going to have these heart palpitations and and need a, an ambulance. Like I was terrified to even like go to the beach because I just didn't want to get too far away from civilization. And so my official diagnosis was actually mixed connective tissue disease. I had seen Dr. Goldner's program months before she and I started working together. I was just so sick of being sick and I was so sick of being tired and exhausted and not being able to keep up with my kids that I decided to go all in and invest in myself because I just knew like if I could feel better, you couldn't put a price on that. Like if I could if I could actually feel better and I could recover, I just didn't feel like you could put a price on that. So the best part of the four week program to me was that, um, I mean, I had like unlimited access to Dr. G and I basically got to ask all my questions and all of my issues were addressed. And um, I, I had somebody there every single day holding me accountable. But what was really amazing is like, I had spent two and a half years focusing on what was on my plate and what was in the blender and not what was going on right here. And this, this was the game changer. Like absolutely the food helps, but stress is like the most inflammatory thing you can put in your body. And that's what I was consuming 24 seven prior to this program. I finished that program in early April. By summertime, my rheumatologist fired me. She said that I was in remission and that my labs were so clean. She didn't want to see me for at least a year. She said we could do lab work every six months, but she didn't want to see me for at least a year. Um, and she was like, Julie, you're healthy. And I am, I'm so healthy. Like my favorite, my absolute favorite part gives me goosebumps is like how much energy I have. Like I wake up in the morning and like, I, I'm not worried that I'm going to crash midday. I'm not worried that I'm going to run out of steam. I'm actually like running all over Disney, like ahead of my kids and they have to keep up with me. Like I, I feel like super mom again. I have all of the energy that I need to like do my daily tasks, keep up with my children, do the stuff that I want to do. I was able to go back to work. I actually coach others. Like I help them with their marriages and their relationships. I'm actually helping people who deal with relationship problems because of health issues, because of lifestyle changes, because of health issues. And so like, I was able to go back to work to do like really rewarding work that I love doing. And I have enough energy for myself, for my family and for my clients so that I can go out there and help other people, which is something I never thought I'd be able to do. When I see people in the Facebook group saying that it costs too much to do rapid recovery, I'm just like, 
baffled by this because what I paid, first of all, there's, it's absolutely priceless. <laughs> My health is priceless. Me being able to keep up with my kids is priceless. Me being able to do what I wanna do and travel again and go to theme parks and go to the beach and do the stuff that I wanna do, priceless. Me not crashing in the middle of the day every single day, absolutely priceless. So you can't even put a price tag on that. So I'm a marriage coach now and I help people in their relationships, but I also am a business coach and I work with people who are launching their businesses just like I did. and. What I see in the business world in terms of high ticket coaching is um, astronomical. There are people that charge $52,000 for a day of working with them, just a day. So when you're talking again about your health and your energy and your life, like this is a steal. This is an absolute steal. This is bargain bottom priced um, because you're talking about your quality of life and that really is priceless. But if you're gonna put a price on it, this is pretty dang cheap. I'm so happy for you, Julie, and thank you so much for sharing your story to inspire others who want to say goodbye to autoimmune disease the way you did. If you want more information about hypernourishment, rapid recovery, or how you can get started, just click the link or go to goodbyelupus.com.